looking at backup. I mean, you see Solo wrapping around on the Doom. He's level three. He has got a war stop. Um, War's going to be dropped down. Solo closing in. There's just no one's MP orbing forward as well. But for him, he's going to turn to the fight as well. MP getting the sound out. Put the fire fight. He's going to live. Rotation in for the Earth Spirit. He's going to be able to phase shift off the roll there. Dodging that from Dooby, but no one's still stuck deep in enemy territory. And MVP, they will be the ones to claim that first blood there. Blink into the pit. A nice silence and a coil. You should be able to take the fight. They have level two coil either. Dooby from the back. What? Three man. Definitely getting it now. Oh, no one is trying to go in, but oh, he's not going to do it. Now he's going to get heavily punished. No, can he play himself out of this one? No, oh, he's gone. 46 seconds on the side for this man, and now Mag, time walking himself away, QO blinks forward, and he's going to find the crush, and Mag, he's in trouble as well, the silence through, and it's another kill for MVP. Make that two on the back of a successful Roche attempt, the 10 for 1. The bandit sounds straight away, no messing around, you can't let them have the chance to get it first pick. I think you can first pick it yourself if you're Vega, yeah, but... Oh, and again! Just two man crush, oh my goodness! Look, don't get humanity, it's not that, it really isn't. What is going on here? This is just an absolute steamroll. Change this one, but they, they no puck. No puck for seven seconds already. Dazzle in a bit of dire straits as QO moves in. Try and look for the wraparound, but Solo, he's been spotted out. Caught out by the stun. Now jumping in for him. Sprouting up. Orchid down as well. Going in the wraparound. Mag. Oh, he gets a three man chrono spare. And that's all done as well for Mag. Mag. The follow board. The Orchid for as well. The way he ran the ground too. Vega. Body three. Triple kill. It's going to be QO down as well. He's just hitting the deck. Another three board. Go on. Trying to find more Mag. Jumps in with the time dilation. Not to fail me. Vega looking for the turn around. QO's going to be able to slither away. And still on the sidelines. Mag. He wants to try and finish off this wish dog to try and make it four kills for the side of Vega. Gets himself the bash, a second oh, bash, yes, orange yes. is on Vegas side here, Ice Rock looking for the turnaround for the CIS squad, can he do enough there at the same time, still playing around with QO, no one chasing down the slaughter. They're not going to be able to find it. Bevy denies the illusion on his way out. The Vens with the foresight. They've scanned it out. They know the room movement here from Vega. The scan here working out for them. And they're in position to fight. Get the stun out to Solo. MP has been spotted. Got out the poison over. It connects onto two. And now we're just to move onto the high ground. But the car's following the back. QO jumps in with a crush onto three. Still the bounces are there. MVP looking to continue. Mag drops the chrono. Catches out Bevy. And MP on the Venomancer. FM from the sidelines. Throwing in the flat cat. They'll take down one. They'll take down two here, Vega. Dominating streak for FM with the crush. Duo. He'll find a second in return, so two for two at this moment in time. There you go. They find themselves anything more, and it looks like they'll leave it as that. So just with pad. Oh, FN, you gotta get out of here, buddy. Oh, he can't afford to give away this one. It's gonna make it a very favorable trade for MVP if they can take down the Jaro. They'll pop the Manta style, removing the Amplified, trying to get himself away, but the bash is there, followed by the Boulder Smash. FN taken down off the match for 55 seconds. Yeah, just making sure they get that objective. They don't want to give Vega the. the oh, kill him! Oh, two shots. My goodness, Jomo, you can try for a CP, but the Bash Lord is here. QO. Here we have it. Add another one. Just to rub soul into the wounds. Godlike for the boy. Are we banning Slardar yet? No, I think we are. I think there'll be a letter from Vega to uh, Ice Rock asking for it to be removed from uh, competitive because Duo is showing us the power of this hero and it's disgusting. Okay. They will drop the two. Maybe this is the turnaround they need. It's a buyback from the puck. And coming out with the Chronosphere, catching them on the sidelines. The bounce is there. Duo should fall down in this situation. He will. But still on the sidelines. MP's coming through. Defense. The barrage and cooldown. They found themselves a second. Moving in for a third. Bevy. Silenced up. Time dilation as well. Slowing him down. And then can he get this kill? The mech's going to be part with a diffuser blade laid down. It's the bashes they'll find themselves a third mp able to tp away the nature's profit as well getting himself out creation for the void that's the biggest issue oh this is beautiful as well but the scans laid down and oh, mvp they, they see it mvp oh, they're God. so good with these scans they know what's up and in fact they want to try and find this one here but at the same time they get coming in qo jumps in crush onto solo and onto fn as well no one they 
shifting off the magnetized for the time being. FN still moving forward with the flat cannon hit. Solo falling low, he's going to be the first to go down. The Chronosphere coming out onto Brev. And Bevy, FN, shipping away from the sidelines, looking for MP. The flat cannon flying through, but the food of restoration is too much. They can't quite finish off these boys. Brev's going to live. Four down on Vega. FN's going to get taken down as well. Death baby. Triple kill for QO, 27 to 10. Want to just constantly fight and just play generally aggressive. It just amplifies it so much.